stories we are doing addition problem stories and trying to understand what is the problem what is the problem in that what is what is the correct word that is used to know whether it's an addition is it in all is it all together is it some of the word the catchy word we need to identify now we are going to do more stories in addition problem okay now here i have a story of two children having some money okay they have some money and now they want to find out what is the total sum of rupees they have put together so they are going to probably it's a pocket money and now let's see let's look at the story okay okay now and has 25 rupees she's collected 25 rupees and has 25 rupees and so has 21 rupees all right and has 25 and so has 21 rupees now the question is what is the sum of rupees they have what is what is the sum when you look at the word sum you know you have to add what is the sum of rupees they have they i mean both have to get they have now that's a question first what are we looking at let's look at and has 25 rupees so has 21 rupees what is the sum sum that's the word we are looking at what is the sum of rupees they have huh they have both together how much is now the you have three state means we need to write number 1 what the first statement you will say amount and has or amount and has 25 rupees amount so has 25 rupees therefore sum of rupees they have a total sum total amount they have together that is we will find out first first is amount amount and has some amount she has next amount so has and then you need to draw a line here and they need to you to write tens and you need to write ones so that you do not go wrong tens one amount and has how much 25 rupees okay amount so has 21 rupees now what is it what is the total sum of rupees that's a question asked therefore the total the total 
sum of rupees they have they have total sum of rupees they have and that will be what we add on here all right and then you need to write answer rupees what it is we'll write okay and that's it now when we add what we remember we add the ones together five ones and one one five plus one six always add the ones two tens and two tens four ten so you have 46 46 rupees so the answer is rupees 46 the total sum of rupees they have is rupees 46 okay and that is one problem now we will do another problem okay now okay so let's write another problem okay the next story problem is Divya has 40 stamps. Now the story. Divya has What does she have? She has 40 stamps. Divya has 40 stamps. And then what else? And then her father gave her another 21 stamps. Her dad, what did her dad do? Her dad gave her, gave her, 23 more. A dad gave her 23 more. Now the question here is, what is the total number of stamps she has? What is? What is the total? What is the total number? of stamps what is the total number of stamps she has that's a question now we need to understand the story here divya has how many stamps 40 stamps her dad gave her 23 more what is the total when you see the word Total means addition. Okay. Now what is going to be the first statement? What could be the first statement? Number of stamps Divya has. Yes. Good. Number of stamps. Number of stamps Divya has. Divya has. And the next statement will be number of stamps dad. Number of stamps given by dad. Number of stamps given by dad. Okay, so we need to do two statements here. All right. Then we need to write tens and ones and then we box it. Okay. Okay. Now, number of stamps Divya has 40. Four, zero. Her dad gave her how many stamps? Number of stamps given by that, 23. Now what do we do? We need to put down tens once 
to help us tens ones to help us okay and then we have the addition sign to help us to add addition sign all right now here first what do we add what is the third statement okay number of stamps divya has 40 number of stamps given by that 23 what's the last question what is the total number of stamps she has so you will write total number of stamps divya has total number total number of stamps that's enough total number of stamps okay what is the total number of stamps now what are we doing we need to add 40 plus 23 now first in the ones place look at the ones and then you add only the ones 0 plus 3 0 ones and 3 ones any number plus 0 is the same number 3 4 tens and 2 tens 4 plus 2 6 tens so now the we have 6 th 3 stamps total number she has got 63 stamps altogether so you will write answer answer 63 stamps what will you write answer 63 stamps okay 63 stamps now here, what have we done here we learn to look at the story addition story the first story says and she has 25 rupees and Susan has 21 rupees. And the question says, what is the sum of rupees they have? Susan and Anne together. Amount Anne has 25 rupees. Amount Sue has 21. Total sum of rupees they have is 46. How many rupees? 46. Another story is Divya having 40 stamps and her dad gives her 23 more stamps and the question is what is the total number of stamps she has now so the statement is number of stamps divya has 40 number of stamps given by dad 23 total number of stamps divya has is 63 40 plus 23 63 stamps so we learn to identify the words sum total meaning plus 